Previously on Safety Geeks SVR. I'm on it! Distinguished male and henchman, stand up! So you just want me to go up there and grab his key? No! Stand back, you silly man! It's far too dangerous! No, it isn't. Yes, it is! I've got his 31-inch tail in my sights! For God, for England, and St. George! Oh! Oh! Told you! Oh! Oh! Sir, I wouldn't hop in this area. It's a safety... Oh, shut up! <laughs> so, Stilton, you were trying to cover your ass, weren't you? Hey, look, I'm a union guy. If they say pack pumpkin scented douches too high, I do it. No questions asked. Well, I have a question for you. What do you think about all the destruction caused here? Well, personally, I think it's a travesty. I see. Yeah, except you guys did it all. Well, maybe the fines you're gonna pay will fix it all. Hey, if you think I'm paying any fines for your mess, you're friggin' nuts. Take him away! Um, who's, uh, who's gonna take me away? You know, just, just so I can help? Presumably, they have people for that. Uh -huh. There's people that do that. People. Take him away, boys! Whoa! Kinda like that. <laughs> I look at them and all manner of violations spring to mind. Yes, this is another one for the files. Where are you going? I'm going to go over there. Why? I want to do something illegal. Uh, I think he's married. Posh Control. Is Hopkins there? Posh Control, can I help you? Hopkins, now, on the blower, on the thing. He isn't here, I'm sure I can help you, Doctor. Yeah, so I guess we've wrapped things up here. You can go ahead and clear the traffic grid and let emergency services through. I am clearing the grid now. 
I, for one, can't imagine the team without you. Well done, Sparky. Thank you, sir. Oh, don't call me sir. Just call me. Yeah, not bad for circus people who are crippled. Well, it makes calling HQ a lot more attractive. Yeah, you're not hard on the eyes. Guys, she's not hot. I mean, well, this is hot. <laughs> Be your wingman. More like bombardier. Who wants some? The phone works both ways, you know. I think we should all go back to HQ, and I think this calls for a bottle of shampoos, eh? Thank you. That's very sweet of you. Yes, thank you, Budwin. See you later. Beefy McMahon stick! I'm hanging up now. Uh, so am I. Can somebody help me? Help! Need any help? They're taking him off the wall. Pierce, I know you've been through a lot, but there's something we need to say. No, no hard feelings, guys, because I can't feel below my neck. Oh, the numbness is from redirecting your chi. I mean, look, I, I drive a forklift, so one of those Steve Hawkins chairs is going to feel like home to me. <laughs> You're not paralyzed. Trust me, you'll feel everything at the hospital. Well, that's good to know. You've just been sighted, mister. Ooh, I bet you that would have hurt. Yeah, not as much as having to slap a heavy fine on the open wound of the victim of a work-related incident. Four hundred dollars? Why would I pay that? Because maybe the fines you pay might help to teach a tard to cross the street more safely. Take him away, boys. Reg, darling, you were supposed to call. Well, I've uh, been busy. You left your speculum at my place. Did I? Well, you did. And it's starting to chafe. Call me. Well, now we all know the nasty truth. You mean you saw me with that melon? No, who's at fault? Well, that. Uh, good. I'll mention it to the mayor when we go off on Friday. Yes, the mayor's always under par. It's his putter, you know. No, don't! Hello, I'm Reginald St. John Smythe, and I'd like to talk a bit about safety. That's why Posh is here. We're making the world safe, one accident at a time. Right. In my travels as a billionaire, I've noticed that accidents are almost everywhere I go. Okay, guys, that was so uncool. Well, I, I was gonna say something. About what? Safety. Oh, what a good idea. I agree. 
if we all try to... I think we should have Randy say something. Yeah, let's let Randy talk. Right. Remember, if you're going to be dancing, always spray down your pole. Now, not something oily, but antibacterial. Why, thank you, Randy. I'll remember to keep my pole clean. Thankfully, I'll never know. And to wrap up, remember, never lift a fully loaded forklift with another forklift and then lie about it. Bad idea. And chance takers always get it in the end. Remember, safety is no accident. Motherfuckers. Chuck. <laughs>